Okay, I have a confession to make, chat. Here's my confession. Amaranth is not as bad as I remember. He's not great. But last time I streamed, there were a couple moments where I was like, all right, he's not too bad. He's not, yeah, he's really not much of anything. He's just kind of there, always asking weird questions to himself. Well, anyway, um, welcome to the stream. We're doing Final Fantasy IX again tonight um, because I want to make some progress. And also, this is a really good part in the game. We're back in Alexandria, which is just great. It's good stuff. Got some good music, good plot, good character development. So we're going to do this. We got Moogles and then Mario Maker 2. Um, anyone looking forward to more Neverhood? That'll be tomorrow. Hang on. Bump. Okay, gonna unplug my controller, plug it back in, and I forgot the limiter, which maybe won't work anyway, but... You know, we try. At least we know it's there. That's the most important thing. And Vivi will just move his hat around a little bit. I forgot to turn my fan on, too. I need, uh... Yeah, I think I need my fan. Tomorrow, everybody will weigh o And, uh, if I can't finish it tomorrow, then we'll weigh o during the week another time and finish up Neverhood. Okay, game is being limited. All right. Anyway, while everyone's piling in, welcome. I'd like to let you know that I made some mistakes today by going to um, an amazing farm place in New Jersey that I've talked about a couple weeks ago. And I bought some delightfully devilish foods. <laughs> so, I, you know, it's not devilish. I didn't get chocolate, but I did get some stuff that is just... Ugh. So good. Alright, I'll tell you about it in a bit. I even have a picture of this ridiculous crumb cake. It's like, not even a crumb cake, it's like a, an apple pie crumb pie. Crump, crumb, crump. I'll crump with your sweetie pie! You wanna buy a set of Phoenix Pinion High Potion Elixir for 777? Yeah. Thanks, buddy. I'll use the money for my next journey. Thinking about how the mist disappeared, I gotta do more traveling to find the answer. I am Artemision, the Magnet Mailman. You're asking me why I don't deliver mail properly? I can't tell you. We read this one already. Fossil Roo is very comfortable. I like it here, Koopa. We play hide-and-seek every day. The most important things in life are to work hard and play hard, Koopa. Maybe not. Yeah, I think we did. Even Moogles want to look beautiful. I'll use my special item very carefully. You don't come across it very often. It's very special to me, Koopa. Right. Okay, we did that. Um... I don't want to advance the plot too far. I want to explore all of Alexandria. The tiny treasure chest. Hit Paul's treasure. <laughs> Great, now I can play cards. Okay, you can't go on the roof. The Roof. So, Beetlejuice is a weird movie. Batman says, I've been a man of the sea up until now, but lately I've been considering piloting airships. Re Regent Sid of Lindblom invented an airship that can fly without the mist. Can you believe that? I wonder if they'll let me on that airship when I go to Lindblom. 
don't know what I have to serve after the new Queen's coronation festivities. Uh, I wish the chef that cooked for Princess Garnet's birthday party would come back. I am the Onion Meister. Yeah, so I didn't stream last night, but um, there was a little bit of beetle juicing. Which all the kids are doing these days. Just juicing them beetles. Do you know anything about Regent Shid's wife? Okay, then. But Regent Shid's wife is very stubborn woman. Uh, okay, thank you. So I haven't seen Beetlejuice in full in like 25 years, maybe? I don't know how they decided to get a kid's cartoon out of that. Aside from this movie has catchphrases. But it is still one of my favorite movies. I love that movie. But Jesus, fuck. Not a kid's movie. Hey, have you been traveling? I haven't seen you in a while. Yeah, Tim Burton at the height of his powers. I haven't watched a Tim Burton movie or a newer Tim, Tim Burton movie in years. I just haven't wanted to. My kitten Mittens ran away. Um, Mittens is right up there. Can't you see? I think Big Fish was probably the last Burton movie that I remember loving. Yo, Vivi, can you do me a favor? What is it? I want you to see Ruby's play with us. I want to walk around some more. That's too bad. Well, at least we know where we have to go. The cat is in the town square. Oh, that was a different cat. That's a... Jape cat. Are you here to see the new queen, too? Do you think Princess Garden will be a good queen for Alexandria? I liked Queen Braun better. Maybe we'll reminisce about Queen Braun's Alexandria someday. I mean, she, yeah, she started a giant war, but uh, yeah, she's great. A lot of things happened during Queen Braun's reign, but overall, it was a good time for us. That's why I put together a wreath made of roses for her gravestone. It was good for them. It wasn't good for thousands of other people. Where did my son go? He's always playing with that cat. <clears throat> what do you mean? We reserved a room for a hundred guild for three nights! Um, no, it's actually 100 gil per night. But I chose this inn because I heard it was 100 gil for three nights. Oh dear, just let's pay 300 gil and stay at this inn. Well, um, it's coronation week, so the rate is 120 gil per night. What? What kind of a business are you running here? Oh, this is the weird mayor that was always busy. In Dolly. He's making such a scene, I'm so embarrassed right now. Yeah, it's kind of embarrassing. You think so too? Oh, what should we do? This is not Link. We can't back down now. What is going on here? I love that Disc 3 starts in pretty much the same way Disc 1 starts. It's a nice callback. You play as Vivi. You're wandering around. A lot has changed. The city is still kind of the same in some ways, even though there's a new queen on the way. But Vivi is not the same by any means. And uh, the world has gotten a little less innocent. Look alike, but inside we're very different. I haven't seen my brother in ages. Family is precious. There are strange men hanging around my shop. You think? Mm. 
Where? Oh, they're on the other characters. Never mind. Just gonna prepare. I need a couple barbets for synthesis. There were there were several times where I was like, "Hey, I could use a barbet." You were menuing in time with the music for a moment there. Was I? Feels good, man. <laughs> no, I'm good. I'm good. today. Angel Bless. I'm gonna need that. For... Oh, I'll just get that now. Fuck it. If any, this is a weird question, but do you happen to miss the way a PS1 game story was formatted around the discs, like Act 1 being Disc 1? No, it was just a technological limitation. I mean, any game could do an Act 1, Act 2, Act 3, Act 4. It's nostalgic on some level, but if a game still wants to do it, they can, you know, a developer can still do it. So, it's alright. Hmm. I think I might get that. I have two Moonstones. Anklet, Maiden's Ring. Oh. Now there's a Maiden's Ring. Uh, I can get, I can get that, but I need an anklet. I need the gold choker for the reflect ring. I think re reflect ring is good. So let me go get a gold choker real quick. Medane, a Medane's ring. That's Zidane's mother's name, Medane. Wait, what did I need? I needed a, um... I don't think I can get it. I don't think they have it. I need the gold choker. No. I need... I needed an anklet. So, anklet is... Sorry, just a little bit of menuing. Gold choker. So, I need to do the gold choker. And then... The anklet. And then, reflect ring. Wow, that was a lot. Vinny, you should play with puppets sometime with viewers. It's another comment from Stupid Poopy Butt. Thank you. I'll take that suggestion into consideration. Stupid Poopy Butt. House, you are Pupat. It's my favorite single line of dialogue in Final Fantasy history. It's um, when Genova says her one line of dialogue for no reason 
on the boat. Genova did not need any dialogue whatsoever. But, and it's spelled wrong. It's great. Um, the boat to the castle is currently out of service. Vinny plans for Dragon Quest Builders 2 sometime. I'm just thinking about playing it tonight, but I am in a... a story thing that is halfway through, and I figured if I'm gonna play, I'd rather have... I Like, I'm in a part, not to spoil it, but I'm in a part in the game where I don't have my stuff, and I wouldn't want to start it there, like on a stream, because I'm halfway through a section. So next week, maybe. It's not really the game's even tied island. It's it's kind of something else. I've been looking to play against an experienced card player. Are you going to challenge me? I've been waiting for this day. This is going to be loud, so uh save your eardrums if you can. But I'm going to kick some ass now. I got good cards now finally. Watch this, watch this move. Good move, good move, fuck. I got one. I did it. These cards are, like, anus. These cards are, like, like hot, spicy, like... Really, um... Day after Taco Bell. Asshole. So I don't really need those, but that's alright. Hey, Sedane. Oh, no. No? Okay. Are you friends with the man sitting at the table? I think his friends went to the mini theater. The mini theater was started by the last owner of this bar and a girl named Ruby. Last night's play was great. I'm so glad I pushed myself to make a great side for it. More like Zedont. I don't have any work when there isn't an event going on in town. Please tell me if someone is hiring. I play a mean trumpet. Yeah, no, that's... That's mean that you would even play that. That's, I hate that noise. I'm gonna be a strong and beautiful woman like Princess Garnet when I grow up. Grandma said she would make a dress for Ilya, but it's taking her forever to finish her. Why, who, why would you just tell us, like, a, a a stranger that? Like, we don't know who Grandma is. Oh, he's old. It's fine. Isn't the new queen a little young? Personally, I think General Beatrix would make a better queen. This little queen is a bit demanding. I wanted to become a soldier when I grew up, but if this is what I'd have to put up with... I'm the queen! My orders are absolute! Hey, what does absolute mean? My son plays too many card games. He needs to exercise. Do you mind racing against hip Hall? Okay, okay. Okay, let's start. When I say go, press X and 8 alternately. On your mark. Get set. Go. Wow. Good job. Hip Hall level 5. I don't like running.
you can keep doing this. And you can get hip hall in shape. I just remember this this whole thing becoming a nightmare. But the question is, is it worth it? I, and I don't know the answer to that. I really don't. It's a card. Speed up? I don't think speed up would help. I'll get one more reward from this, but then uh, that's that's about as much as I can do. We gotta do jump rope. Ugh, we gotta do jump rope. We gotta race, man. Well, I already did jump rope in the beginning of the game. There's no more jump rope, so that that's that's a moot point by now. But. You get a lot of rare cards for doing this. Oh, so it's just cards? If Hip Hall was in any other game world, maybe he would be playing like a, a fake Game Boy. Like if this was Final Fantasy VIII, Hip Hall would be definitely playing a Game Boy of some sort. I think I'm getting better, says Hip Hall. Fine, one more race. Not two more races, two more races, because then we can... We can get the reward. If you get Hip Hall to level 1000, he joins your party. Oh, is that how you revive Aerith and also get the, uh, the Triforce in Zeld? His mom is selling his cards away after turning him into a pro athlete. I mean, she's pretty much just giving his cards away to some random stranger. Oh, this is how you get Luigi 64. Hell yeah. Okay, well, I got three cards for that. That's good enough. Ilya's dress isn't finished yet. Oh, this is the, the grandma. Cannot carry another potion. It's the saddest message in all of life. Yeah, this is definitely one of my video game towns that I would love to live at. Alexandria. I've said Zeal is probably number one. Lynn Bloom, Alexandria, and this game are both great. I mean, Dolly's great too. They're all pretty fucking awesome. The main cities and towns on the Mist Continent. He said to meet him here, but he's late. Scoops ahoy. She's late. I wonder if she ditched me. Well, you people have no sense of spatial awareness. You think Princess Garnet is in love? I wonder if the boy and the girl standing over there are lovers. God. Could you imagine these two driving a car? about yourself. Do you like to drive? Actually, considering I just watched Beetlejuice again, that is the most Beetlejuice thing that could happen. They could drive, and uh, then Beetlejuice begins. Real quick, 
So this is this is the mistake I made today. I got this. It is an apple pie crumb cake. And it is stupid. So I went to New Jersey today. Um, I, I went, and it was beautiful out, so I took a little drive. And I went to that place I was mentioning. It's called Delicious Orchid... Or Orchards. It's not an orchid. And, um... Yeah, I got some stuff. I got a fucking zucchini that I cooked up today. Along with some fresh hot dog that I made. Oh, so good. And I got that. What else did I get? Um, apple cider donuts. Dangerous. Apple cider, cranberry, apple cider. Uh... What else? Coconut limeade. Just... We, I can eat uh, apples and pie and cider. I, I can do that stuff. Bro. You and Ruby really don't get along very well. Blank. Don't you know I hate it when you're late? Oh, oh I th <laughs> when you're late. How many times I gotta tell you, huh? Who are you? Strange. Kinda. Uh, hey, VV. Is he a friend of yours, Cinna? Hello, Uncle Cinna. <laughs> I'm not old enough to be your uncle. I'm younger than I look! I don't even remember the voice I did for him. Ha <laughs> ha, you're a funny one. I like you. Wanna see my play, little fella? Um, yeah. Oh, what a sweetie. I like you even more. We'll get rolling in a minute. Sit wherever you want. I think your plan worked. Ain't nothing to it. Blank, we'll talk later. Busted. Steiner? Never more than a moment away. Yes, Princess! Um... I'd like to find Zidane and talk to him. Princess, you have more important matters at hand. You live in a different world now. Oh, what's happening here? Princess, it is time for you to get changed. General Beatrix, will you help her? Yes, sir. Oh, there is something I must give you, Princess. Those stones contain your power, which Queen Braun forcibly... Well, that is all in the past. The nose knows. They're jewels. They're jewels, Garnet. Master Steiner? Master Steiner, do you intend to stay here and watch? No, I, I am not. Excuse me. Beatrix. I'd like to see Zidane, please. Now may not be a good time. Even you agree with Steiner? Your Highness. I know, it's okay. With that, with Garnet out of the picture, now's my chance to win Zidane's heart. Oh, it's Echo's theme mixed with Melodies of Life. Or not Melodies of Life. But the, the main theme. First, I'll write a love letter. I'm gonna make it the most romantic letter ever written. In the comments to the previous Final Fantasy IX stream, people kept pointing out that Aiko has, like, scoliosis. I never noticed it, but then if you look at the exact frame, like, her back doesn't make any sense. Becoming a queen may place quite a burden on Princess Garnet. But she must persevere. The people of Alexandria are waiting. He looks pretty smart. Hey, you look like the bookish type. <laughs> I'll 
gives you that impression? You really want me to explain? Oh, yes, I'm very curious. Where should I start? First, your beard. Second, your nerdy hat. Third, your thick eyeglasses. All signs of a nerdy philosopher. Oh, 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 oh you don't hold back, do you? Hey, are you a writer? Well, yes, I did make a living as a writer for a while. Will you help me write a letter? A letter? Gladly, if you think I can be of assistance. Okay, then. Follow me. That girl has a horn. That horn. I had completely forgotten about it until now. I'd never been as surprised as I was that day. A ship drifted ashore after a storm. Inside the ship were a woman and a baby girl. This is Dr. Tot speaking, I guess. Um, the woman was dead, but the girl was still breathing. Imagine my surprise as I looked into the girl's face. Because the girl looked exactly like Princess Garnet, who had just passed away. With one exception. She had a horn. A human with a horn. Where had she come from? The king ordered the girl's horn removed. The girl cried out in pain. He and his wife, Queen Bronn, decided to raise the girl as Princess Garnet. But that girl who spoke to me, could she be related to Princess Garnet? The first... You know, this is a detail I totally fucking forgot. This is a complete... Like... Weird. So wait, the original Garnet died? So they had a daughter, passed away, and then there was another. Huh. Hey, will you hurry up? Oh, excuse me. Princess, you look splendid. Thank you. By the way... There is something I must tell you, Beatrix. Yes, Princess? I am not my mother's... I mean, Queen Braun is not my real mother. Princess Garnet. Dr. Todd has already informed us. However... My allegiance to you remains the same, if not stronger. Vinny, how does your car smell now? It's been some days since the disinfection incident. Zero to five percent rubbing alcohol smell, so it's pretty much gone. But my trunk, squeaky clean. Beatrix, thank you. Yeah, it's a good time to talk about that disinfection incident during that scene. It's finished. The dame will fall in love with me the instant he reads this letter. Thanks, mister. <laughs> it's my pleasure, my lady. Oh, I forgot to tell you, my name is Aiko. I'm from... I mean, ain't sorry. I hope to see you again. Bye-bye. From Madain Sari. Madain Sari is the village of summoners. But I thought it was only a legend. What could this mean? What is going on here? <laughs> yeah, now would be a good time to ask. Now would be a fantastic time for him to be like, Hey, excuse me, is that place real? Vinny, I saw Jerry's sign friend live tonight and couldn't help but hear yours and other people's impressions. 
Yeah, that's that's one of those people that definitely the outside world seeps into his whole persona. It's a little weird. But anyway, I hope you enjoyed him. I haven't seen him live, so I don't know. Uh, I can't wait to hand this letter to Zidane. Where did he go anyway? Ah, help! Hey, are you alright? You can't breathe! Sorry, I didn't see you jump out. But you're too high up. I can't get you down. <laughs> Stop laughing, you poop! Ah, shoot, my letter. Hey, if you can't get me down... Deliver that letter to Zidane, all right? To Zidane? Yeah, no problem. <laughs> what am I supposed to do now? Hey, the boat ain't here. Castle patrol completed. Huh? Why, if it isn't Baku, the leader of Tantalus. Who just called my name? Oh. Oh, it's you. Should we capture him? No. He saved my life. You may go. I will handle this. Yes, sir. Ain't such a knucklehead anymore, huh? Silence! This is no place for thieves. You must leave, now. So that's how it is, huh? Do I gotta remind you that one of my boys saved your kingdom? But I bet you ain't got no ears for listening to a lowlife like me. Are you talking about Zidane? Yes, he did protect the princess and her kingdom. But that doesn't change the fact that you are all thieves. You cannot let your kind roam about the castle. No appreciation whatsoever, eh? Well, I don't got any reason to stay here anyway. Hey, you know where Zidane might be? He hasn't visited the castle since we returned. Maybe he can teach you a thing or two about proper manners. Okay, I get your point. I've had enough of your self-righteousness. Gwahahahaha. Perfect timing! Take me into town. You you dropped the you dropped the letter. Oh, so it was Steiner. I thought I heard him yelling. Uh oh. Uh -oh. Alexandria is at peace again, yet my heart is full of sorrow. Why? Hmm? Steiner must have dropped this. Let's see. When the night sky wears the moon as its pendant, I shall await you at the dock. What is this letter? Did Steiner... Write me a love letter? Steiner. <laughs> Darn it. You're all cozy on your throne already? No. No, no, no. I can't start my day without Garnet. Her smile, her voice. Her voice is like a beautiful song. And her song make me soar high into the sky, Mark. But now... Who's this? You can still fly high, darling. Ruby? Yep. Zidane, you can do it. She's right! Why are you still moping? This isn't like you at all. Yeah. Stop it. You don't understand how I feel. Whoa. Long time no see, Zidane. What happened? You look pathetic. Boss, let me join Tantalus again. We can steal treasure together, just like old times. Treasure, eh? There ain't much treasure lying around this world, boy. Besides... 
Tantalus always gets what he sets his eye on. That's our rule number one, remember? No, you don't. You got no right to join us. You don't understand what I'm saying? If you can't even capture a canary, you ain't got what it takes to join Tantalus. What boss? Hey, Zidane, can we go see Garnet? <laughs> Why can't you be more honest like this little guy? Can we, can we? Please? Uh, Alright. Let's cheer her on before she becomes a queen. Yeah. What a career change, huh? You are my queen! Darn, I forgot to give Zidane that letter. Huh? Huh? <laughs> I lost it! <laughs> Just want to hear the honk again. The cats in this game all look pretty scummy. Like, they, they, I don't know, they just look like they're very smelly. I'm Ashley, I run this mini theater with Ruby. Nice to meet you. Weren't you a thief earlier on? Oh no, Ruby's mad. It's gonna be a long wait. You should stay away from Ruby for a while. Is there anything we can do? There's so many things to prepare for Princess Garnet's coronation. Again, this song always felt like a Final Fantasy VIII song to me. Well, I haven't seen you in a while, Freya. That's a Dane. Doesn't even stop by to say hello. Oh god, here we go. I'm not letting him off the hook that easily. What are you staring at? Are you really that tough? Try me! I don't go looking for trouble. But I'll fight back if trouble finds me. Why don't you apologize? And maybe I'll forgive you. Ha! Like, like how? Court, and there's guards here? Stop right now! Or I'll charge you both with disorderly conduct. Hey, what's, what's going on here? Zidane, I'd love to stop and talk, but I'm busy right now. Is she a friend of yours? Then I'll tell her who I am. Tell her I'm the Flaming Amaranth. Sorry, Amaranth, she's just a little worked up about something. Sorry, babe, they're my friends. <laughs> Will you let them go for my sake? Sure. Princess Garnet asked us to give special treatment to you, Master Vivi, and Miss Freya. Garnet. Uh, I see. Thanks. Hey, Freya. Stop being so mad, alright? Do you know why I'm really mad? Because of you. Where have you been? Garnet's about to become queen and you're off wandering about. Have you found out anything more about Kuja? Well, answer me. Um... Well, I tried to find out more info, but... Look, if Kuja was, was responsible for taking Garnet's Eidolons... ...and killing Braun, who was working with him... ...don't you think he'd come after Garnet again? I know. What can I do? I couldn't even talk to her, remember? I don't even know if I can protect her. Besides... She's going to be queen. She'll have all the guards she needs. She won't need me. But, Zidane, I think Garnet wants to see you. So, let's go see her. 
Yeah. But we'll leave as soon as we're done. Zidane. You're not getting away from me. You still owe me a rematch. So yourself. Cool character that's just there. Ugh. You wish to battle? Ugh! Oh, hey, a new person. Are you strong? Ah! Nice to meet you. Do you wish to fight me? Ah! Do some menuing. Gotta do some menuing. Get that MP plus ten percent. Got a new weapon. Get to learn thievery. Get, um, ability up. I'm gonna keep that. And what else? Shit, the thing Amaran has is really good. You wish to use my accessory too? Make Amaranth a tank. Wait, no, I can't. Not yet. Now I can. It's very tanky now. Uh, for, for. What did I get here? I got, um, and mug. No. I got no nothing of use, really. Um, let's, let's get rid of bug killer for a second. I'm gonna put alert on so we don't get caught with our pants down, as they say. What's wrong with Mug? It does damage. And when you're trying to steal stuff, you don't want that. Especially uh, if you got Queen on your team and you need them to eat. Because they might accidentally kill. And you don't want them to kill when you could eat. Vinny, who says that and why? What do you- what? What do you mean, like, the thing that's- what? Um... Who's the popcorn mascot? Oh, they- oh, the pants down. Who's they? I think they say that in the Navy. Old Navy. Yep, the store, they say it there, yeah. You can reach the harbor by riding the Neptune statue. Wow, statue transportation. Wait, is that, is that where I want to go? I don't fucking know. Let's, let's just... I don't remember this. Vinny, the army in this game doesn't wear any pants, though. That is true, yes. This transportation makes no sense. How's it gonna get back? 
the red rose can't fly because there's no mist. All oh, right, the mist. Restricted access. G Jay, you know who I am. My name is Zidane. I saved the kingdom. Watch, watch it go up. Oh, wait, I guess it doesn't. Wait, what? Ah. I'm fascinated by this technology. Just floodgates and then it goes up and... I'm sure it's real, I'm just- I believe... Yeah, it, it could- it could work, maybe. It's magic, and it ain't gotta explain shit. True. True. Ah, let go! Ouch. This is no way to treat a lady. Quit screaming or I'll throw you into the dungeon. Ah! <laughs> what happened, Aiko? To Dane. Oh, it was horrible. He called me a liar and a loudmouth and a brat. He's right. What did you just say? Do you want to repeat that? Man, I hate kids. Calm down a little. What is your name? Me? I'm Aiko. Echo Carol of Mid Maiden from Madain Sari. Why, I've never heard of it. Don't you know anything? Madain Sari is a silence. What are you all doing here? This is the royal castle. You do not belong here. Hello, Mr. Steiner. Master Vivi, it is a pleasure to see you again. We came here to see Garnet, the princess. Hmm. If that is Master Vivi's wish, I shall arrange a meeting. Master Vivi can warm even Steiner's heart. You all wait right there. Princess, we are ready! Thank you for coming, everyone. Goodbye. Walks off. She looks beautiful. Wow. You look beautiful. Splendid. Zidane, have you nothing to say? Uh, no. Princess, we must go now. All right. Garnet, wait. Garnet, is this the last time we're ever going to see each other? Oh, no, of course not. I won't be able to wander around the world with you anymore. But I'll never forget our journey together. Garnet, I wanted us to remain good rivals forever. <laughs> rivals? Echo, you say funny things sometimes. Oh, there are some things I wanted to give you. Let's trade the jewels as a symbol of our friendship. Two of my jewels. Two of my jewels. Goodbye. Echo. Just Jordan. Jordan to the right. Why didn't you say anything to her, Zidane? I don't know. I tried. And? I couldn't say anything. I had a whole speech ready for her. But it would have been a lie. How could I lie to her? Good luck, Garnet. I'll be watching you from afar. Come find me if you need someone to talk to. It's a big fat lie. It's not how I feel at all. It's just not how I feel. At all. God, this music. This is- this is the music. Right here. Like, deep sadness music. I love the way this sounds, too. The instrumentation, it's so fucking good. Okay. So there's only room for Garnet and Zidane's heart. 
I wish I hadn't written that stupid letter. Sedane looks so sad. Isn't there anything I could do for him? Ah, Sedane, I hate you! You insensitive fool. You don't even know how I feel. I feel bad about ditching him, but I really don't feel like seeing him tonight. I gotta hide before he shows up. Shoot. Someone's coming. Could it be Zidane? Well, that got cut short. There's no one here, bro. I guess I'm early. Maybe. I wonder who wrote you that love letter. <laughs> well, just read the letter. I bet she's beautiful. Really? Are you sure you didn't write it yourself? I mean, you caught the letter falling from the floor above you, right? I'm telling you, she was too shy to hand me the letter herself. If you don't think I'm a ladies' man, you're wrong. Chicks are intimidated by good-looking guys. That's why someone's coming! Marcus, don't interrupt me while I'm talking. Let's hide, bro! All right, all right. The gang... The gang mistakes a letter for their own. I must tighten up security around the castle from now on. Dusk to dawn, rain or shine, I must patrol the castle. Right. Clear. Left. Clear. Huh? It's a piece of paper. This looks like a letter. <laughs> Let's see. When the night sky wears the moon as its pendant, I shall await you at the dock. M my goodness! This is a love letter! Who wrote it to whom? Hmm. No address or addressee. Did someone drop it here knowing that I would pass by? Who could it have been? Steiner. Beatrix. Was it you? Thump thump. Are they in love? Bro! Shh, quiet. Steiner. Beatrix. Ooh, what's gonna happen? My nose is bleeding. And stick your thumb in it. Achoo! Achoo! Boss? Oh, you totally ruined the scene. <laughs> Perfect. That's a Dane. Where did he go? Who knows? I'll go look for him. Ah! Hey, watch it! I'm not in a good mood right now. Stay out of my way! Excuse me? Have you seen a young lady named Aiko? Oh. It's the nerdy guy. Ha! <laughs> You're as energetic as ever. Yep, I'm always energetic. I'm actually hurting on the inside from being rejected by Zidane. Did you say something? No, I didn't. Didn't you come here to talk to me about something? Oh, yes, I almost forgot. Your village. What was the name? Madain Sari. Yes, I wanted to ask you a few questions about Madain Sari. Sure, I'll tell you everything I know. You help me out. But why don't we go to your place? We can relax there. To my home? My home is located in Traino. It's a bit far from here. Traino? Sounds like a cool place. I'm really interested in sightseeing. I want to go there. I'm coming with you. There's a card game tournament going on in Traino right now. I want to participate. Card game tournament? Oh, that sounds fun. I want to go too. I'd like to go as well. Traino, huh? Ha! Ha ha! Quite a party this is becoming. It would be my pleasure. We shall all go to Traino. <laughs> the gang goes to Evo. Um... There's still mist here. Kinda looks like the Aoife tree before we got rid of the mist. 
I don't think the mist is as dense as it was before. Yes, I heard that you all stopped the mist. The mist permeated through the roots. That's probably why it still lingers here. This is a gargant? You forget how weird this shit is for people who haven't seen it yet. Yes, shall we? Clowns on a dark night. That's me. No one is here. Is no one here really? Yes! Sure you are about that? That is enough! Now, we do what? We are going to ask Princess Garnet if we can return to the castle. Return to the castle? Can we really? I will not know until... We must hide! I, I like how Blank and Marcus are always busy doing skullduggery. <sighs> Looks like there's no one here. Yeah. I guess this is about the only thing we can do for Zidane. Keep up the night watch and preserve Alexandria's peace. Yeah, I think so too. What a peaceful night. It's almost scary. Okay, let's finish our rounds. All right. It's not so much skullduggery. It's actually quite noble of them. That was close. Now what? We cannot stay as long as those meddlers are here. We must leave Alexandria. This song always reminded me of that Phil Collins song. Um, it's a Genesis song. What is the name of that fucking song? I play it. I've played it a bunch. I could stay, but I won't go. That's all is the name of it. Yeah, it just has a similar vibe with the um the the, the hi hat and the p piano and all that stuff. I never knew about the secret passage. I apologize for the lack of space. It's fine. Hey, Amaranth, have you been here before? What about you? Me? Uh, I've been to every place where there are beautiful women. Can we talk about Medane Sari later? I want to go sightseeing. Oh, of course. There's no hurry. What are you staring at? Let's go. <laughs> who, 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 me? Yes, you! This is my first time in Traino! Show me around! Then I shall go as well. I'll take the chance to relax. What about you, Amaranth? We could have some bonding time. I don't understand him. You know, today is the last day for the card game tournament registration. Well, then I'd better go register. I'm a skilled card player. Please let me know if you need assistance. Hey, I'm not so out of practice that I need your help. I see. Well, good luck. Um, why didn't you... Why didn't I invite... Why didn't I invite Zidane? Y yeah. Those two are thick like bricks. They don't realize how they feel about one another until they're apart. What do you mean? Ah, you big dope! Okay, listen carefully. Zidane really likes Garnet. But Zidane wants to act cool, so they misunderstand each other and end up fighting. Now, do you understand? Not really. Zidane wouldn't stop acting cool in front of me, either. It's so hopeless. Hey, what's that? Is that the card stadium? Hey, wait. She's gone. Hey, you're... Huh? Would you like to play a card game with me? Yes. Just this one time. Where's my limiter on? My delay is a little too high. Alright, just remember, you're gonna, if you're asleep, you're gonna wake up. Even though, how are you sleeping and listening? 
to this at the same time. You liar. that win. God damn. What if I just became like a Final Fantasy 9 card game streamer and that's it. That's all I stream. Just the card game over and over and over again. I never expected to run into you again. Um, thank you very much for your help on the airship. Hey, no worries. My master's a good man. Anyone else would have refused. You should thank my master. He's the one who agreed to take you to Alexandria for free. Yeah. So, how was the play? Did you like it? Y yeah. Well, wasn't there an accident during the show? Were you okay? Oh, um, well, yeah, I was okay. Good! Well, I gotta get back to work. Hey, don't you live near Traino? Yes, I, I do. Your family must be worried. Go home soon. See ya. Grandpa's gone. Well, since I'm so close to home, I might as well stop by. Vinny, you can play against real people on the Final Fantasy IX launcher. Oh, Eleven launcher. Really? This exact card game? Nothing's changed. Damn it, that bird lady didn't fall for it. Gotta find my next scam. Damn, ain't you gonna apologize for walking through me like that? <laughs> hey, I'm talking to you. Don't you know who I am? No. What? I'm the infamous... Huh? I've seen you somewhere before. Y you're The Flaming Amaranth. I'm sorry. What happened, Amaranth? That guy was totally frightened. Oh, I know. You were being a bully, weren't you? My grandpa always told me that bullies are actually cowards. Just leave me alone. <laughs> so he's traveling with a kid. Never knew the Flaming Amaranth had a soft spot for kids. Well now, excuse me. So weird. Amaranth, where are you going? So weird. <laughs> It's like this this dude, everyone's afraid of this dude. And this like little girl just keeps putting him in his place. Vinny, why are you yelling? I think it works. It kind of works for her, doesn't it? That girl with the ribbon in her hair and the boy with the pointy hat looked suspicious. I won't always yell for Aiko, but that was the, that was the time to do it. Also, every character calls her a loudmouth, so... I can spot my kind a mile away. You're a thief, aren't you? Hey, you, you must be a thief, but, but I'm not scared of you. So yeah, now you can see what the mist continent looks like without the mists. So people that were complaining about the draw distance, 
Your wish has been granted. Oh, I can't wait for this bird to activate Zidane's trance. Imagine getting this mad over a fucking bird. Imagine imagining things where you imagine things. Imagine things. These are like low level enemy scum, aren't they? Fast. Oh, Jesus. Where's this Quan? This is where Quan lives? Where's where's Quan live? No, Quan Quan over here. You can disable encounters? How? What 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 do? Oh, it's in the settings. It's not like a... Well, what is this one on the right there? That's a cheat. It disables achievements. Never mind then. Oh, that was it? Okay. I think I'm still getting Chivos. Vinny, do you really care about achievements? Not really, but I mean... I like reading the names of them sometimes. The toggle cheats do not disable achievements. Okay. Well, I don't want to disable achievements or fast forward during, like, you know, a, like, vital parts of the game. My main reason for doing that is chocobo stuff or just backtracking. So. Mmm. Soup. Vinny, they actually did fuck up the overworld in this port. How so? Maybe? What are you doing here? Zidane, how did you find me? What are you doing in a dump like this? I... I used to live here. Really? You used to live near Traino? Yeah, with my grandpa. So how did you end up living with your grandfather? Well... Hungry. Maybe his end of attempting to fish mist from sky and eat it. It's no possible to prove theory of nourishment with no eating. Hmm? I catch something. So you were... My grandpa... He fished me out of the sky. Excuse the fuck me? Maybe I fell off of a cargo ship. I not know how... I catch something from Mist Ocean. You no need be afraid. Maybe I eat him, but he's still so small. My grandpa was very kind to me. He used to worry that I wasn't growing properly. Let's see. Let's go, Zidane. There's no reason to stay here. Right. There's something at the bottom of the ledge in the ocean. Looks like foam. My grandpa almost ate me. The clock stopped. Stopped about a week before we kidnapped Garnet.
Let's see, six months since I adopted Vivi. Still too small to eat. <laughs> good, good grandpa. I already got all the stuff here. I was here previously. But... BB lived here for over six months. Black mages have a 12-month lifespan. Well, hang on a minute. Remember, VV is... different than the other ones. Wasn't there a story beat? I don't want to spoil anything if not. Wasn't there a story beat? VV is a Nexus 8. Exactly. VV is, is like, um... a different type of replicant. VB is like nine years old. Oh yeah, it's true. But I think th there was a story beat where they they said that he was a defect. VB's age is only an estimate based on his size. Or a prototype, not a defect, but a prototype. Um, the only thing you. The age thing is just when you recruit him. Hell yeah, the overworld is so much better now. Holy fuck. The mist disappeared and the cable car stopped working. Cool bridge. Hey, maybe fix your bridge. No amount of hardship can tear our two countries apart. Friendship between Lindblom and Alexandria. As Lindblom lie in ruins because of Alexandria's aggression. Go to Dolly. I, I say nothing, chat. I say nothing because why say many word when only few word do trick? I didn't know they were being used for war. I volunteered to look after the cargo ship only because I like watching airships. I'm tired. Poor Morid. Are you here to see Morid? Yes. Morid is outside enjoying the sun. I'm worried about Morid because he seems so depressed once the cargo ship stopped coming. Nope, I'm here to steal coffee. It's been a while since we've been here. Factory's gone, the farm is gone, what's gonna happen to us? I can still run around because I don't have to help tend the farm. Yeah, this little village was being used. Welcome. The factory closed down, but my daughter is ecstatic about us running the shop together again. I'd love to take my daughter on a trip with the money I saved, but we have our own store. We can't leave. Hey, would you look after the store for a week? Yes. Thank you. I'll remember your kindness. Yes, I say. Knowing that will never happen.
Xenor says, no, thank you this time. No, you should understand, I do appreciate it very much, but I'm, I'm very much... I don't want any more subs. I didn't want to encourage more, because whenever I say thank you for one thing, then more people sub. So, I, I can't, I can't thank you anymore after today. I can't believe I have to interrupt the stream with this. But... I do. Looks like the mayor isn't here. Finally, I can check the room. Uh... Any brawn... What, what is this kid doing here? Yeah, just save your money for charity next year. That would be very appreciated. The charity stream? Who's there? Oh. I seriously don't know what the fuck is wrong with this child. Is there anything else to do here? Or is that it? Vinny, why wouldn't you just take the sub money and donate it to charity if you don't want it? I will. Next year, I'll definitely have a big amount to give to charity, but keep in mind, Twitch gets half of the sub money. So, oof. I think I got the key, right? I got the kushkushka. <laughs> what did I get? <laughs> I don't even know what the fuck that is. I got, um, the kushkushka. Ah, uh, yes, the, you know, the kushkushka. Look at all. You like the Kashkushka. It is... Uh, it is a hat, yes. Okay, never mind then. I thought those two treasure chests would be a little bit better than that. It's completely sealed. Gonna need the key to open this up. It says Mayor's Key here. Um... So what now? Check one place again and again to lull the kid back to sleep. The child is now asleep. I think. Oh, okay. This is a weird puzzle. Got it. Well, people in chat were calling it a puzzle. This is very much not a puzzle. But it's still puzzle-like. I don't know. I guess it's kind of a puzzle. Chocobo. Hi. Hi, Chocobo. 30,000 gil. town is now broke.
There's something under the treasure box. Berman coffee. Okay. What is it with Ricks? Does that count as a key item? Got three coffees. I got mocha. I've got Berman. Each cup makes you forget the hustle and bustle of daily life. Come get the experience of a lifetime. I've got Kerman. Roasting coffee beans slowly enhances their rich flavor and aroma. Did you know that? I got everything else I need in town. I just want to talk a little bit. We're not usually open during the day. He's a special case. Do you need some medicine? Hee-haw! Hail to the new queen! Why'd she have to shut down the factory as soon as I joined in? It's always like this. I missed out on a financial opportunity! Hoping that people would start tending the farm again once the factory closed down. I'm so glad the mist is gone, but I've lost all enthusiasm for work. We haven't even run the windmill in days. Well, doesn't that... just blow? You have this nice farm, this nice little town, and no one wants to do anything about it anymore. Oh, oh my! Those are legendary coffee beans I've been looking for! Would you mind giving me those beans? I've been thinking about those beans. Oh, thank you. I can't imagine the trouble you must have gone through to get them. Oh, I'm so happy. I never imagined I'd get to drink all of the rare coffees of the world. I've never felt so happy. I am ready to join my dearly departed wife now. What, like, you gonna die, dude? Don't do that. What the fuck? I don't think I've ever done this subquest before. Got a model of the theater ship. Will you take it for me? I'll send you the model of the theater ship. What, would you have my address? Do you... Would you have my P.O. box? Do you... Are you gonna send it to the Garnet, the castle, the queen? Are you gonna send it to Steiner? Is Vivi gonna get it? What are you- you don't even know who I am! You don't even know my name! Morid seems very happy now. Even though he just said something particularly morbid. The o the sky in the overworld is supposed to be blue, not white. Okay, so when the mist is gone, the sky is supposed to be blue. Don't go inside the cavern. The ice is melting inside. It might come crashing down. I've never seen this before. This playthrough of Final Fantasy IX has been most educational for me. I've played through this game... ...in, like, in full, probably about four times, I'd say. This'll be my fifth. I think it's about four. I think. Jeez. Or this might be my fourth. <laughs> Regardless, this playthrough has been, so far, the most detailed. I feel like I've seen the most new things, I've learned more. I, um, I'm getting a lot out of it. I'm processing some of the stuff with my big boy, 
uh, moist brain as opposed to small boy dry brain. <laughs> I don't even know what that means, sorry. But... And yeah, the visual mods are great. The fact that it looks better than it ever has makes this pretty nice. There's some visual glitches and some sound crust, of course, um, including overly loud sound effects. But other than that, this has been a very good playthrough so far. Which is why I'm pleased to inform you that I will be quitting midway through and we will never see the ending of this game. Goodbye. No, really what I wanted to say was this. I am therefore leaving immediately for Nepal, where I intend to live as a goat. Someone said, is this new meme? No, that's from the uh, 80s. Darn, it's empty. We've got a wide selection. Nope, it's like Beetlejuice honking his, his dick. That's a very old thing. Also, that, that wasn't a meme, that was just a little video clip that I played. I think you need to uh, re-up your definition of the word meme. So, our houses are crappy, but at least they're still standing. Wait, is that a knock on Lindblom? Are you trying to say that Lindblom's houses suck? Did you not see the giant monster in the sky with the suck mouth that was sucking the houses and people into them? Maybe I'm reading into this a little bit too much. I bet the roof of a mansion doesn't leak when it rains. Trados famous auction. Too much bidding and the price goes high. I ain't got no money to buy. Well, that's life. Can I even play some cards? No, not really. This dog has been harassing this Moogle for years. Artemisian just delivered a letter to me, but he said this might be the last time. What did he mean by that, Kupo? From Kupo to Mogrich. There's an amazing new champion sprinter in the town of Alexandria. The sprinter's name is Hippal. He's amazing. Remember that name, Kupo. <laughs> wow, Kupo. But I still want to know what Artemisian meant, Kupo. He's already a fucking champion. It would have been Vivi if you got to level 50. Interesting. Ah, a new scummily textured monster is beneath the cage. Very nice. Sure, I can't guarantee your safety. Oh, Zidane will fight the monster. Ah, probably not worth stealing. I feel like that was a waste of 
time more than anything else. Then you get stronger the more stuff you steal. Oh. Told you. Don't be such a fool next time. Does that count as a beast? Yes, right? Probably a beast. So we'll throw on counter. We'll get Beast Killer. And I'll just peel manually. Snake Eater. Uh, yep, I think I'm good. I don't have the other stuff that I need, so I'll just... Uh, those two will have to do the trick. I don't have Auto Potion right now, so... I mean, I could, but I'll just stick with Counter. Devil's Bell? Is that like Hell's Bells? Oh, okay. can't believe it. Here's your prize. Man, look how much money we're getting. The Dane is goddamn rich. Waste it all on the auction? Yes. He can buy his way into nobility so Garnet pays attention to him now. Zidane is going to become Littlefinger. Well, I suppose, Garnet, I suppose that you and I will find a ladder. To love. Purchased a life-sized griffin statue the other day. Ah, how wonderful. I'll bet it's gorgeous. Indeed it is. I had to add a room to my mansion for it. Oh my! Everything costs so much. I'm also thinking about buying a behemoth statue for our mansion. Everything costs so much. Oh, tee -hee. Oh. Hmm. I guess city people have their problems, too. W why was that so slow? Was that supposed to be like that? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> was that a glitch? Apparently that was a glitch. Oh fuck, it was so much better like that anyway. I thought they would be more carefree. Kupapo. Hey, what are you doing? Hello, little girl. Oh, you're the one who was being pushed around by Amaranth. <laughs> Don't be silly. So, what can I do for you, Mr. Wimpy? Alright. Hey, are you new here? Uh-huh, I'm sightseeing. Hey, why don't uh, I show you around? No thanks, I'm fine by myself. 
Wait, wait! Damn it, now I gotta deal with this brat. I just need to nab her and get even with Amarant. Bounty on his head is mine for the taking. I'm leaving! Oh, wait, I'll take you out to dinner. Dinner? That's right. What would you like to eat? Treno gelato, seaweed pasta, the choice is yours. You say you have delicious food? Yeah, lots of delicious. Huh? Hey, Queena! You say you have delicious food? Oh, what the, who the heck are you? I want delicious food! Why do I gotta... Are you part of Amaranth's posse? Maybe Amaranth hired him to protect the girl? I'm sorry! Give delicious food! It's so weird. Kupapo. Hey, he dropped something. Finally, Queena does something of interest and useful. Thank you, Queena. And now I just have it. It's just here. Today's the big game. A man must win his big game, son. You say that every day, Dad. What do you want? I have nothing to say to the likes of you. Oh, yes, I'm happy just to be with you. I'm sorry, we only serve members here. I'm so glad you joined me for tea again tonight. The writings on Stellatio must mean something, don't you think? Boop. We have received five Stellatio from you. Oh yes, Libra! Give it to me in return for a reward! Will you give me a Libra? Oh, you are most kind! Now give it to me! Collecting slots here. Oh. That's all we got. Just those two. No other ambitions in life? No, no, no. Her other ambitions are things that, like, ducks would do, I guess. Uh, what do ducks do? They fly in V's in the sky. They... make honk, quack noise, and they fucking, and they, they dip their, like, long necks into water and poop. And eat peas very fast. Many things come into Traino. This means you can always find something new. Oh, wait, I got a barbet now. What, what can I make with the barbet? Yep. 
Never mind, can't use it yet. Yeah, it's for Garnet or Echo. Now I have to find the damn auction house. I gotta get that David Gilmore guitar. It'll only go for $2,000, don't worry about it. Save before trying to get it? Sure. Yeah, no, it's okay. The, the David Gilmore thing. You know what? I can pretend I have a David Gilmore guitar. I can just write David Gilmore on it in, in like, crayon or blood. And, uh... And I'm good. These your guitars? You feeling okay? That's it, I've had it with you! But honey, we might use it someday. Today's item of all a rare item mini seed, the claimed feather boots, a rare item Yoon's mirror, the claimed dark matter, first. Rare item mini Sid. Run to the bedroom. The suitcase on the left, you'll find my favorite axe. The Dark Matter. Okay, I, I want to make a bid for this. Um, what would be a good starting bid? Maybe, maybe 10,000? Wow. I got it! 13-2. Was- was that good? What the fuck, that's amazing, said the Final Fantasy 9 expert in chat. W what does it usually go for? Twenty-five thousand. It maxes at twenty-five thousand. Holy fuck! Well, I got it. It summons Odin. Wait, they just had something that could summon Odin. Isn't this the thing that destroyed Clara earlier? It's an Ender Pearl. Don't even want to know how they got that. I will ask no such questions. Get Yoon's, Doga's, and Rat Tail from the auction. Why would I need that stuff again? to sell. They're rare and cool. It sells for money. I'm good. If I need money, that's fine, but... Kuja owns the auction house. Oh, maybe he brought it there after disc one. Why 
I don't think he owns it. I mean, he was there earlier in the game, for sure. Very much so. Just tell me what he's like. Well, they're talking about the card game champion. What? She's a cutie in a sailor's uniform? Wow, I'd love to challenge her. See? Now go ahead and register. Sure, I'll register. Anything to meet this girl. You're registered now. Please enter through the gate. The game will begin automatically. I think this is the only time in the game where you're forced to play cards. It's just a lot of luck. Congratulations, advance to the second round when ready, or go inside and play right now. I'll, I'll save. Oh, it's you, Amaranth. What are you doing, looking at the lake? I... Thought you'd be the quiet type. Sorry, maybe I've changed. It's probably his influence. Sedane, huh? So, did you find what you were looking for? Well, I've been investigating Kuja. Some people seem to think that the king, king, the owner of this mansion, is Kuja. Oh, oh, well, there you go then. True, I found people who witnessed Kuja on his property. But there is no proof that Kuja is Lord King. <laughs> what do you know? No, nothing, really. Maybe I can find out the truth from the mansion's auctioneer. Don't hold your breath. So what's your story? You seem to know your way around. Are you also here for a reason? Who, me? I am only an unemployed security guard. Security guard? It was painfully dull until the day he showed up. <laughs> I've said too much. Hey, wait. What? You're interested in hearing about my past? Of course I'm interested. Amaranth is Kylo Ren, apparently. Good morning! This is where he and I met for the first time. Who is he? Sedane. I thought the two of you just met. I don't think he remembers. I was working as a security guard at this mansion. I was looking for a fight. It didn't matter who, as long as he was strong. Thief. That was too easy. That was too easy. Who are you? You look like a worthy opponent. <laughs> hmm. So you're the King family's infamous new security guard, huh? What if I am? Hasn't got me any action yet. Come on, fight me. Hmm. So you're just a thug. What did you call me? 
My favorite kind. I'll knock you out in one minute flat. Don't disappoint me. Where did that thief go? <laughs> Here they come. I won't let them interfere. Come on. Don't be silly. The game's over. What? H help! He came out of that door as I was passing by. I was staring at him because I thought he might be a burglar, and then he started pummeling me. But he's a guard for this mansion. That's why he's suspicious. Look at him. We always had our suspicions, but... I'm gonna call the police. You guys hold him off until he get they get here. I'll tell you one thing. The truly mighty ones don't flaunt their power. How can I describe it to you? The sly eagle hides its claws. Hmm. I'm out of here. Bye bye. We've got you now. Yeah, right. Hey, don't run away. What the fuck is happening here? So you. I became a wanted man. <laughs> What's so funny? Sorry, I just didn't expect you'd fall for such a childish trick. It's no concern of yours. I'm sorry. I see, so that's what happened. Don't get me wrong. I don't hold a grudge against him. But I need to understand him. He doesn't flaunt his power. He only cares about being with his friends. <laughs> you were destined to meet each other again. Two men walking on the same path are destined to confront each other one day. <laughs> That's what a man told me some time ago. Freya, I love him. Honesty is a virtue. That's if you can manage to stay alive. Yeah, the whole amaranth. That's as much amaranth as you're gonna get, by the way, chat. There's, there's not much more than that. So bizarre. No, there's more. I mean, there's more, but that seems like the biggest, like, dose of it. So weird! Sorry, I'm waking everybody up. This, this game just brings it out of me. Amaranth is on the front cover of this game. That's like putting Jar Jar Binks on the cover of Star... Oh, wait a minute. What was this? Amaranth story seems like it would have worked if this stuff happened during the actual story instead of one flashback and a bad attitude. There, I, I get, you know, having, like, um, a dark, edgy character could work in an ensemble. Like, it's worked in Final Fantasy plenty of times. It's just because the late 90s was such a strange time, and coming off of, like, grunge heroes and, like, you know, dark, depressing time in, or what, in you know, pop culture. That's my guess. I don't know if it's right. It's just a little guess I have. You know, we got, like, edgy... Instead of, like, Shadow being a peripheral character in 6, we got, like, main character Edgelord in 7, and main character Edgelord in 8. And side character Edgelord in 7 as well, if you think about it, with Vincent. It was very anti-hero heavy kind of stuff. But I, I do like... I really do like an anti-hero or, like, a dark, edgy character if it's done right, and the characters are self-aware about... Uh, or aware of it. And, and, you know, they can, like, poke fun at him, like they're doing with Amaranth, but it's just, the character's too goddamn lame.
Jesus fucking Christ. Why did I do that? Oh, it's okay, it was a draw. Uh, I could have won if I placed the card on the bottom. I just, I fucked up. Yeah, I don't really even fully understand the numbers. I just, you know, just look, do a quick glance. Okay, numbers bigger. Put it down. So make no mistake, it's not like I know what I'm doing. Oh! Why did you have 89? Somehow I won. Uh, some really, again, like shitty, shitty cards. First number attack type letter. Uh, okay, number attack type letter attack type. Next two are defense. A word of caution: you only have one chance to play in the final round. Be careful. Find a Moogle and save now if you have any doubts. Thank you. <sighs> Hungry. Special chili. I try to travel to eat many foods from different cities. But why you need Gil to eat anything? I cannot eat without Gil. Oh, light on water look like food. It's just an illusion. But maybe real. I go jump in. No, I drown if I jump. But I hungry. Hungry! Suicide, eh? I've seen many people commit suicide because of, of gambling debts. What a what a shame. Well, rest in peace. Wow, okay. I forgot about that. That's some shit. Premonition. I'm back! Welcome back. How did you like Traino? Hmm. It was okay. Do you prefer your own village? Yeah, but it's fun to meet different people. I've only had my Moogles till now. Just the Moogles? Well, what about the others? Well, they're gone. I'm all alone now. I see. So you are the sole survivor of the Summoner Tribe. Why does everyone want to know about my horn in the Eidolons? Oh, I, I'm a researcher of sorts, so I'm just curious. I see. Oh yeah, you were Garnet's teacher, right? Well, yes! Teach me how to become a graceful princess like her. <laughs> the princess used to be a rumb rumbustious girl, just like you. Rumbustious, what? Do you think I can be just like her when I grow up? Oh, of course! I'm glad to hear that. You see, Garnet gave me her mark of, a, of the princess. The mark of the princess? Yeah, Garnet gave me one of hers, and now she's got two, and I've got two. Do you mean the legendary crystals? Unruly, rambunctious, rumbun... Rum, same thing. Yeah, that's what Garnet called them, too. Uh, I see. So the crystal was divided. One piece remained in Alexandria, while the others were sent to Clara, Lindblom, and... The Summoner tribe took the last piece to Madain Sari. But why did they have to split the crystal? What happened 500 years ago to prompt such action? Ah, excuse me. I'm sorry, I get lost in my thoughts sometime. Miss Aiko? Mog is calling me. Mog wanted to talk to a Moogle she met here in Traino, so I left her there. But something's wrong. I have a bad feeling about this. I've got to go get Mog. Uh-oh. Are you George Clooney? Try again. Are you Michael Keaton? 
Nope. The buttballs. Buttballs. <laughs> the cartoon bars and... <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> that lady's voice fucking kills me. <laughs> Don't bring back butt marl. No, 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 it's all good. This way, Regent. Yes, I know, but remember my condition. Please, Regent, you must behave like a champion. Let's register. It's the champion. Here she comes. I'm the champion, Aaron. I'd like to enter the tournament, please. Ah, we've been waiting for you. Please go inside. Thanks. Hey. Ew, Dad, it's an oglop. Shoot, shoot, go away, you filthy oglop. Um, I'm sorry, but this oglop is my... champion's pet? I I'm sorry. It's okay. Since when am I your pet? Quack! Well, you are an oglop right now, after all. Silence! Quack! I'm the champion! Quack, quack! No one understands. Do they play cards in a totally pitch black room? I heard the champion is a master of winning games with Oglop cards. Her name is Erin the Oglop Master. Clean out Sid and get all of the cards. Oh, that's that's horse cock. Wow, I didn't know you were the champ, Aaron. Yeah. Fast forward from the start. Oh God, the controller is double inputting again. Okay. play. Excellent work. Excellent works. God damn it. Thank <laughs> you. 
out fucking RNG'd more like it. I own that corner now, that's my corner. Rebirth ring. Congratulations, you're the winner. <clears throat> well then, first try. Wow, I didn't know you were the champ, Aaron. Long time no see, Mr. Zidane. Don't be ridiculous, I'm the champion. Hey, Regent Sid. Still an oglop, I see. And you still haven't learned any manners. Ah, cut me some slack, will ya? What are you doing here, anyway? Mainly participating in the tournament, but there was something I wanted to test. What are you testing? A new airship, Hildegard II. The one that can fly without mist? Correct. We can't go very fast yet, but we made it to Trano. Well, why now? I have a funny feeling there'll be more trouble on the horizon. Don't you worry, I'm sure our almighty... Our almighty... Uh, I'm sure our alm... Don't you worry, I'm sure our almighty Queen Garnet will take care of everything. Oh no, this is horrible! What's up, Eiko? Oh, it's horrible, a Moogle from Traino just told me! Well, what's wrong, Gwok? It's Alexandria, something horrible is happening. Peace is but a shadow of death. Desperate to forget its painful past. Though we hope for promising years, after shedding a thousand tears, yesterday's sorrow constantly nears. And while the moon still shines blue, by dawn it will turn to scarlet hue. <laughs> what an auspicious day for Alexandria. Garnet's ascension to the throne has brought hope and peace to this kingdom. The people are overjoyed. They believe a wonderful future is ahead of them. But the celebration isn't over yet. It's time to really light things up! Your former master is here, Bahamut. Pay a requiem for her and all of Alexandria. More death and destruction. The nice, peaceful city of Alexandria. Hey, Paul. Run faster. You know you can do it. You're a champion. Your Highness! It's Bahamut, isn't it? Beatrix, please gather our soldiers. Yes, Your Highness! Our soldiers have already assembled and await your orders. <laughs> Hurry up, you fools! This is an emergency! Get your act together before the princess arrives! Line up! Your Highness, as you can see, we are ready to act at any time. Please give your orders. Oh, Jesus. I, I was going to save the game. I didn't realize this was happening so soon, all this craziness. Um, hang on a minute. Let's send Coel. We'll gather information. We'll gather all the information you need, Highness. Okay, and then protect the townsfolk will be Weimar and Hagen. 
Your Highness, on our lives, we'll protect the citizens of Alexandria. And then contact Lindblom to request for reinforcements. Mario Maker's gonna happen as soon as I hit a save point. But, boy, this was inconvenient. Um, Eric and Laudo, contact Lindblom. This does matter. And the cannons will be Dojabon and Molenkadine. We'll shoot that monster down in no time, your highness. You were splendid, your highness. Beatrix, let's go. Everyone's gone. I don't know what to do. Mother, I need your help. Oh, that painting. That fucking painting. Oh god, this music, yes. Oh. This is it, Beatrix. I will give my all for Alexandria. Well said! Let us march on to victory! To victory! My headphones came off when I did that. And the textures are fucked. It's been a while since Steiny was in the party. Hang on a second. I'm just messing with some levels on the limiter. Uh, sorry for the Mario Maker delay tonight. I- this was not my intention. I just wanted to play some cards, man. Accuracy plus. I don't know why I even said it like that. Now, oh, Steiner. Someone said Mario Maker always gets shafted. Well, I mean, it's a type of game I can shaft a little bit because it's such an, uh, an open-ended, freeform thing. And we're, like, on, like, part 20 of Mario Maker, so... Santa, where are you going? I don't know. Beware, Beatrix. The enemy is close! But I have to, like, in, in a lot of ways, doing this game first is almost, ne almost a necessity. Because by the time I get to the end of the night, I can't fucking read anymore. I mean, I'm barely holding on now. Can you go get the secret boss here? It's worth it. Um, that's back at the castle. Can I go there now, or...? Later? Okay. Something about a despicable beast. For her highness, for the princess! S fight the book when you switch over to the other party. Okay. Yeah, the textures on certain monsters have been fucked since the beginning. I don't really know why.
I don't think you can't give her abilities. Prepare to die. This is a compatibility mod with Moguri and an NPC texture mod. Okay. Where's the mod to replace Amaranth with Beatrix permanently? I don't know. I want that one. Beatrix, are you alright? Fine, what about you? You're wounded. It's just a scratch. Persistent bastards. Beatrix, like, died. And, and Steiner is the one who is being like... Like, are you okay? Yeah, she's basically a paladin. The team does not have a paladin. But there is a mod to, apparently, you know, put her in the party permanently. This is futile. Let us return to the castle. No, I cannot face the princess until we destroy all these beasts. On my honor, I vow to protect the princess, the citizens of Alexandria, and... And Beatrix, I, I shall protect you! S Steiner. Watch out! Steiner, we have to get you out of those jorts. Maybe then. Yeah, that's the stuff. Might be it for us. I have no regrets. Beatrix, there is something I must tell you. What is it? I... I save your valediction, Steiner. We'll live to see another day. I'm a clown. What? Yes, I, before I became a guard for the princess, I was a clown. Steiner, that doesn't even make any sense. These clowns don't make any sense! Steiner, you have pants now! Anything for you, my love. Were you a good clown? No, I was shit at it! I didn't make anyone laugh! I was a creepy clown with jorts! I hear music. Where is it? Where is it coming from? Is it coming from upstairs?
Odin. Did Vinny fight the book at least? I don't think I can fight the book yet. Can't even summon Jotun. Can't go to the... Okay. How did that castle do that? What is this place? I still hear the music. Where, where is it coming from? What am I doing here? Mother. The Dane. No. I can't depend on them anymore. As the Queen of Alexandria, I must protect my kingdom. The ship is rocking pretty bad. It can't be helped. I designed this ship as an oglop after all, so I have no oh, idea what could happen. Sounds like it might crash any minute. Perhaps. But I think we can at least make it to Alexandria. Oh man, I guess we'd better cross our fingers. Zidane... I'm starting to feel sick. It's probably from the flight. Go inside and get some rest. Try to stay in the middle of the ship. You'll feel less moved. Go on, Vivi. Oh, okay. Thanks. Echo? What? I saw something sparkle. Huh? Garnet. Garnet. Echo, what's going on? Thought I just heard Garnet's voice. Geez, something's wrong with the ship. This light. Maybe it's just... Maybe it's the Holy Judgment. Holy Judgment. Hey, what are you doing? The summoner is being called. Alexander's Judgment has come. Ah, <laughs> Why are you here? I heard your voice of the on the airship. No wonder. I felt your presence too, and all of a sudden I was covered in light. It's happening again. Garnet, this is the light of destiny. Light of destiny? The summoner's light of destiny brought on by the hidden powers of the four jewels. This light appears when a holy Eidolon calls for its summoner. Come on, Garnet. As summoners, we have to fulfill our destiny. But... I don't know what to do. It's okay, I'll show you. First, we have to put our hands together.
like this. Uh huh. Now pray in your heart. Patty cake. Darkness overshadows us once again. Oh, holy guardian, hear our prayers. Deliver us out of darkness into light. Kind of seems like Bahamut stopped the attack. Oh no, Bahamut's still here. Boy, this looks familiar. Drogon, no! Drogon, stop! I bet, um, Echo's gonna say to Garnet about Kuja, I know a killer when I see one. Cool fucking cutscene, though. So, Alexandria Castle was Alexander the whole time. It's so beautiful. Alexander, the legendary Eidolon. So, you wish to defend the castle with your brilliant wings? How admirable. Your powers even transcend Bahamut's. Alexander, I've been waiting for you. I've called a magic carriage for you. I'm sure you'll like it. Invincible, come forth. You're mine, Alexander. You have gone too far, Kuja. I granted you the freedom to do as you wish in Gaia for one purpose alone. Now that you have lost sight of your mission, I will no longer tolerate your actions. You have not the slightest idea whom you are defying. I will show you soon enough. You too, Zidane. That's right, Chad. It's solid as snake. What happened to the Invincible? Enslave Alexander, as you have enslaved Bahamut! Could it be? Garland? Impossible. Why would he come to Gaia? If it is indeed Garland, he must know my plan. But why has he assumed control of the Invincible? No. He can't be. Whew. That was quite a trip. You little bug. We could have been killed. I've never played Final Fantasy 1, so I have no idea if there's a connection. Amaranth's right. It was a mistake to come here on that airship. Well, we had to get here somehow! Come on, guys. We made it here in one piece. That's all that matters. Walk, walk! That's right! <sighs> never gonna ride on an airship again. Never, ever. 
Sorry, Phoebe. Sorry, sorry, Phoebe! Captain! Uh, where is her highness? I don't know. We're looking for her, too. Shoot, I must find the captain. Alright, let's go find Garnet. We have to find Aiko, too. We're probably together. Okay, I know this is like kind of a really tense moment, but now I can save. Oh, we're leaving off on a on a fucking cliffhanger. color blue, and the object two spheres come to mind when I think about what the save point represents. So, yeah, no, this is good. This is a good place to stop. Um, thank you for watching. Um, yeah, a lot of good stuff up ahead. Who's Garland? Who's the G-Man? Who's, um, you know, what's Kuja? Uh, why is he wearing a thong? All these questions and more will probably not be answered. But um, early next week, we'll do more Final Fantasy IX. So I'll see you then with more of this. going to take a quick break. Um, I'll be back with an hour of Mario Maker. So you can go someplace if you want, but you don't have to. Stick around.